Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forex, pisami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation of the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Greetings everybody, let's take a look again on the euro currency. So, uh, since market has moved slightly higher yesterday, actually, we haven't got the retracement that we discussed. Everything still stands the same in terms of the, our expectations of the targets. Uh, those who have positions uh, could keep these positions, just manage your stops while market is coming higher. But for a new enter, for taking the new position, uh, we're still waiting for a pullback. So, if we haven't got it, Yesterday, we are waiting where it will happen. We suggest that pullback should be uh, relatively small. We do not expect a deep drop uh, as euro stands in upward thrusting action here. So, but hopefully we will get it within the, maybe today, tomorrow. Tomorrow it will be the non-farm pros release and markets right now starting to preparing for that. And so everybody will take a look what is going on in the uh, largest economy, the employment market. So currently in this day, you can see the market hits the intermediate target that we discussed. This is minor target. This is actually 127 extension of this swing. So our primary target on the daily chart stands at 2264, uh, 2260 approximately, it's right here. This is XOP of this ABCD patient. This is also 1618 extension of this swing and also target of the breakout of the broken rectangle here but on the way up market hits uh, also minor intermediate targets one run seven extension market is not that ever bad it means that it's good theoretically to continue up protection but still if if we will get lucky and market show will show the pullback we are watching for the same level so yesterday with this minor pullback we haven't got even 30 percent support retracement because it was standing here currently we use absolutely the same levels but now they stand a bit higher because market also has moved slightly higher. So currently the first level 20, uh, 47 and the confidence stands take a look right at 120 even. So uh, these two levels to consider if market will show some retracement. That's particular what we'll keep an eye on. Retracement theoretically is possible uh, because of this target, as I said, this minor reaction could follow. And take a look on the hourly chart, market takes two significant angles. So it's too fast upper action is too steep significant acceleration compares to this one action because this was flatter here as it stands moving higher and uh, that's taking the shape of the wedge pattern that potentially this is bearish pattern that uh, well sends friendly to the possible relief possible retracement for the market uh, also you can see here is the bearish, bearish divergence exists well uh, potentially it could be either one leg retracement or take a look here potentially we could get even kind of the two leg retracement so it could be shoulder head market will show this ABC retracement a bit lower well in this case we'll keep watching on the levels but approximately it will be still around the 120 maybe slightly lower in general anyway this this major sport cluster previous top this has been broken here this will be major prime major object for a possible pullback uh, so let's keep watching for those who would like to go short, currently we do not see good stops. Uh, oral market tendency stands positive. Uh, it's relatively strong. So and here only in some very low time frames so on the five minute chart, maybe on the 15 minute chart, you will find something to short. But currently on the hourly, four hour, daily and higher, it's not time for taking the short. For bullish traders, you could keep the positions if you have. Those who do not have it, as I said, let's hope that we will get the pullback because Theoretically, once sooner or later it will happen, and uh, fortunately it will happen before market will hit our uh, 2260 target. So that's our view on your currency for nearest couple of sessions probably.